Hi, I'm Jennifer Vaughn with Luxury Lake Oconee Real Estate Group, and I'm joined here today with Jerry Fowler from Bank South Mortgage, and we are going to discuss the current real estate market and mortgage rates and how that impacts you if you're looking to buy or sell your home. If you have been watching the news lately or reading the paper, you may be concerned about the housing market. I have several clients who've been asking me about why now is a great time to buy, and I'm here today with Jerry Fowler from Bank South Mortgage. So Jerry, what can you tell me about mortgage rates? Uh, what are we seeing and what do you think you're going to see in the next few months? Uh, we've actually returned to um, basically the 2019 level pre-pandemic. Um, sales are still robust. This is a, we're in a great area. Um, we're a little isolated from the news mm -hmm. um, that's throughout the country as far as the market goes. Mm -hmm. um, we have a different clientele of borrowers buying second homes and moving here for their primary residence. So that's gonna keep our market strong. Today's rates on conventional money is in the, the mid to high five, uh, mid fives, probably 5.375, five and a half. The unusual thing is jumbo rates, which is anything over 647, 200, which is a lot of our market, they're actually cheaper than conventional money, and they're in the, the five, five and an eighth range. Uh, we do have loan programs for the first time home buyer. Um, in this market, well in any market now, the, um, the price points and the, uh, the ability to build affordable housing has become an issue across the country. So uh, there's a couple of things that we can do that kind of help that buyer get in there. Um, there's two one buy downs where the seller can buy their rate down for the first couple of years and then we resume to a normal level. So they get a much better rate starting, but it only lasts for two years. So Jerry, one of the things that I have clients looking for a deal, everybody's wondering when are the, all the foreclosures going to happen? When are we going to be able to get a deal in this area? And I keep saying it's not going to happen. This market is very different from the 2008 market. What can you tell me about that with mortgage rates? You're exactly right. Mm -hmm. This we're, we're not going to see that in this market. The, the quality of loans that we have sent to, to Fannie and Freddie and to the investors over the last couple of years is just stellar, probably some of the best they've ever put on their books. Um, the high-end pricing is going to stay stable. Um, and we do a lot of studies, and if you take 2002 to 2022, you know, the, the average appreciation over that 20 years is 4%, which is normal. And you had a, a spike in, nine, in 20 and 21, which were, you know, 25%, but it's leveled off. So we'll continue to see steady appreciation in our price points here at the lake and I don't think you'll see very many foreclosures at all. Jerry, one of the things that I have been looking at is in the market when there is, if there is a pending recession, mortgage rates have typically responded to that by going lower during a recession in the last six times we've had a recession. Correct. What's happening is they're, they're trying to slow things down. So in an effort to do that, they've raised the rates. Mm -hmm. uh, as they continue to slow the pace down, they're gonna need to reduce the rates in order to keep it going. So. You know, they need to buy their house today, do their mortgage, right. and not be overly concerned about the rate. Um, because in two years, we're going to call you back and go, hey, we can save you a lot of money, and you've gotten the house you wanted, mm -hmm. and now you have a lower house payment. And what news do you have for a first time home buyer? So I know in our market, we have uh, traditionally like a, a second time home buyer or a second home buyer. If you are somebody that's just entering, you're renting. Why should you think about getting into a home and getting being a first time home buyer right now? Well, rents are going to change every year. Mm -hmm. uh, and the lack of housing is forcing rental prices up. So you're going to see a, a rapid appreciation in your rent payment on a monthly basis is the longer you stay in and rent. If you're a first time home buyer and you can get in a home, you know what that payment is going to be for the next 30 years. Mm -hmm. So you can plan your budget and plan accordingly based on today's money. Well, thank you, so. Jerry. I appreciate all you taught me today yeah. and look forward to working with you soon. All right. Thank you.